Live. What's happening right now from RTV6, the Indy Channel. And we begin now at 5.30 with what you need to know tonight to stay safe on the 4th of July. People all over the state will shoot off fireworks tonight. Most will do it safely, but there are bound to be injuries that are avoidable. His name is New York, and like the famed city, he plans to put on a good fireworks show tonight. And New York says safety comes first. Safety does come first. And if we do have a bunch of kids around us, they're going to be far, far away from us and to where they can actually enjoy themselves. And for a good reason, the number of fireworks-related injuries nationally were at their highest in more than a decade, according to the U.S. Consumer Product Safety Commission. These can be life-changing injuries, some of the things we do see with the hand injuries, eye injuries, facial injuries. So, again, be very careful out there. On Friday, the Southside Fireworks Store is crowded with shoppers. Fireworks are big business since the state loosened regulations in 2006. This is a fuse cover so that uh, we don't have any accidental um, uh, ignition. The industry says safety is its top priority. We are the most tested product in the United States. Uh, CPSC, uh, Consumer Product Safety Commission, tests our products and we have an ind independent lab that does that as well so that when we bring our product into the United States. They have been tested. They have been they're proved safe and for consumer use. Safe in the right hands. Still, 8,700 injuries caused by fireworks were treated in emergency rooms in 2012, and an estimated 17,800 fires were caused by fireworks in 2011. Now, a spokesman for the Indianapolis Fire Department told me today they prefer that people never shoot off fireworks and recommend that you go to a professional show instead.